great thing about solo cruising, when people see somebody by themselves trying to take pictures, they always offer to see if you want them to take pictures. So. today and I was going to get off the ship I was gonna meet up with some of the other solos who were going to the fish fry because I've never been there but just didn't feel like this this morning so again changed my mind which I do a lot on the cruise so this is a beautiful morning we are right next to the sun rises so for today I'm gonna to relax a bit and then I'm not sure what else I'm going to get into today but we will see So I decided to walk the track again. So I'm um, walking the track and it's a nice day, it's beautiful, but it's a little bit overcast, but it's still beautiful. We got a nice little wind, a nice little breeze going up here and it's nice. Covered strawberries, but I'm scared to eat them because I don't know if this is like cake that's on it. I told them that I needed a um, to make sure it was gluten free. So uh, I don't know. I'm just I'm a little bit nervous about. I had one of the chocolates there, but uh, I think we're gonna have to verify that this is not like cake or something on there. Every time I do this trick, I think about Bobby. <laughs> And just like that, it is almost over. Yes, so tomorrow morning is debarkation day. So it this has been a great birthday cruise, a nice little three-day getaway. You know, I cannot believe that when I first started so solo cruising, I was mainly doing three-day cruises, but I was actually flying in from Georgia to do a three-day cruise. It's, it's, over before you know it a little uh three-day getaway um i mean it's nice if it's because sometimes that's all you can do if that's all the time that you have yes i would do it again now i am about to do another show there's a 80s show that i haven't seen i don't think i think he uh dr e said it was brand new so i'm gonna do that and then top the night oh something i don't know so i'm gonna do that and then top the night off with a little comedy and then uh, it's gonna be time to turn in and debarkation tomorrow but no fear because i have a cruise in two weeks on the carnival mardi gras Please give a round of applause for my sanitizer. Yeah. It's not even impressed. Either. This brought to you in part by Purell. <laughs> Buy one, get one free. And Kleenex. Mm. You, I do do windows. Shh, that, you gonna have to feed the dog. <laughs> Shh, 
Don't worry about the sanitizer. Thank you, sanitizer. Okay. Do you want to introduce the next person? No, no, you should. No, you can. No, I didn't finish sanitizing. <laughs> <laughs> Are you finished? Yes. Wait. <laughs> okay, enough about that. <laughs> I feel so shiny right now. Come on, when he said, let's go. Vacation day and I already had breakfast uh, and I am on my way out the door now I am trying to hurry up get back home so I can jump on my uh, laptop and go to work this morning so I'm interested to see how long this is gonna take so let's get going all right so made it back home and I am about to get to work it took about um, an hour and 15 minutes only because um the pay stations were broken and well the pay stations were not functioning in the garage so there was a long line waiting to uh check out or pay as you exit the garage and that actually took the longest time so i would say i was in line for a good 20 maybe even 30 minutes um but made it back home and uh, about to get to work. Now, my next cruise is back on the Carnival Mardi Gras on March 5th for the celebration. <laughs> so looking forward to having a good time on the Carnival Mardi Gras again. A third step. It's it's really down there, and I can't. <laughs> Every time I try to dip down, it seems like I keep going and going and going. So yeah, I think this this step here is it's about all that I'm going to do. 